Alright man, um, so this video I like to talk about how to fix crash for the Dyson Sapphire program. So first of all you're gonna go right click and go to properties and from here uh, you're gonna go to the local files and fr from here you just click verify integrity of game files. So what it does it if you have like any corrupt files it will like fix it for you and it, you don't have to worry about the file anymore. So, yeah, you can just, you know, um, yeah, you can, like, uh, verify the files, and second thing is, make sure you have the latest driver, alright, so, um, this is the game I have right now, and you just go to details, and, uh, as you can see, it's perfect settings, go to your drivers, Make sure it's up to date. If you're an AMD user, and make sure um, your AMD driver is also up to date. And the last and finally, you have to go to the, your NVIDIA control panel, um, which is let me just you can right click and find NVIDIA control panel. If you can't find it, you have to go to the control panel. And from here, make sure you put a large icons, and then go to the NVIDIA control panel from here. And once you come here, you're gonna go. Make sure your this PHYSX settings is by default is your GPU instead of your CPU. So um, why I'm using GPU is because my GPU is more powerful than my processor. I would say yeah. Um, so because if I go to the task manager performance. And uh, I don't know where's yeah I just have only six core processor, so six core is kind of bad uh, for a processor. So I'm just uh, put my uh, GPU. So it that's a possible fix you can do. Again, if this will help, please subscribe. That would much appreciate it. Thanks for watching and uh, have a nice day, guys.